Hello, I'm Rick Barron from WABK Radio. On behalf of all of us at WABK, I would like to thank you for purchasing this video. Part of the proceeds are going to WABK's First Aid, our Flood Victim Relief Fund. We'd like to thank Visions of Maine and you. Already we brought in $5,000 from the sales of these videos. This is kind of a pretty picture behind us, isn't it? The Kennebec River flowing lazily by. We're about to kick off whatever week, as this is being filmed, a week-long celebration of the Kennebec River. Yet it was just two and a half months ago when the Father Curran Bridge was almost covered by water. And uh, water would have been about 15 to 20 feet over the roof of this WABK green machine. What you're about to see is a compilation of footage throughout central Maine, some of the area's hardest hit by the flood. So I hope you sit back and relax and... Uh, Relive a little bit of the great flood of 87, the 500-year flood. This is normally a nice, quiet little river. Look at yeah. that, there's a there's a big tank. Way up there. Yeah. Is there a chance of that exploding? No. It's it's oil, it's not gas. Oh my egg and worse, it's gonna hit hard too. Look. Watch when that hits. Listen. Right now. Yeah, boom. Oh, it's Look at that. Forcing it right under. No, pushing no. it, it's gonna. Pushing it. There it goes. of the boat here. Yeah? <laughs> the oarsman. Yeah. You're taking pictures? Right now. We're going to go back by the deli. Got some clean. Clear. Clear. Full speed ahead. Turn <laughs> <laughs> on the afterburners. Okay. 
full power coming up. Maybe. What are we hung up on, Dan? Well, Jason's that's boiling and slimy. Oh, that's awful. all over this thing. Front end room. The lots, the empty lots on Lithgow Street in Winslow. This is the place where seven houses used to stand. They've been swept away by the Kennebec during the flood of 87. Do you have any idea of when the water's gonna be going down over here? Or? Uh, 24 to 36 hours, that road should be open. Is the bridge gonna be passable, do you think? It should be passable, yes. How many houses do you think you lost down through here? Uh, unofficially, I think we've lost six, but uh, we haven't been over in the area to really to check it out. Any leakage from uh, Bill's Oil or Chase? Or? I'm sure there is, yes. Yeah. And the railroad bridge that stood up all right? Stood up fine, yep. The side crew, can you get across there? Or? No, we can't get across it. We've got fire engines and a crew on the other side. This, I guess, uh, no personal injuries? No personal Murray injuries at all. We know. There was a lot of people Thank checking. you very much. You're welcome. Ansel, Ansel Grendel, uh, fire chief of Winslow. Uh, Winslow Fire Department here in Winslow, Maine. By the pictures, they see everything. There's a hot, lot of heartbreak here. A lot of loss. It's devastating. Seven homes gone. And you come onto the front lawn of the Winslow Public Library. If you can believe this, there's a watermark halfway up the doors leading into the library. What you are seeing here is one of those houses that was swept off its foundation. And this is what's left. You might ask yourself how something that looks so peaceful and tranquil now could have been such a raging monster just three days ago. As you can see, one of the trailers is right over on its side. Another one next to it is almost as bad all the way through the trailer park. Damage is quite severe. Well, there you have it, a little bit of history. If you'll want to hang on to this tape, show your friends and neighbors and relatives from out of state, chances are we'll never see another flood like this. Let's hope not, anyway, in our lifetimes. By the way, coming soon from Visions of Maine Productions, the great Kennebec whatever race. You'll see a 60-minute video highlight of the people and the floats involved in this year's race. Stop by a Home Vision video store near you for more information.